hello it's saturday and i found a good spot um on this tree and there's my bike <laughs> just to draw a little bit outside the weather's been so lovely and there are like little leaves falling all over my head but it's fine and i also got attacked by a giant mosquito but it's it's lovely um and the sun's just setting over there so Oh, I hope I don't get bird poop on my head, but it's really nice to just draw outside and, you know, enjoy this lovely weather while it lasts. <laughs> so, yeah, that's what I'm doing. Okay, a warning for people who don't like bugs, skip this section, but look, there's a little caterpillar in my hair. Oh no, I don't want to squish you. I don't want to squish you. Oh, it's not even a caterpillar. It's just a tree twig. Oh my god, no, there is an actual caterpillar. I was just looking in the wrong space. Wait, I'll try to find it. Here it is. Here it is. In the wind. Can you see it? Can you see it? Where is it? Oh, it's here. I can't even see you properly. Did you leave? Did you go? Where'd you go? Oh, you're there. Okay. <laughs> little after dinner and I'm starting to get drowsy so <laughs> I'm going to attach some pin backs also kind of don't feel like vlogging the whole process so I'll just do a cool transition instead three two wait wait I'm do this three two one Ta -da! <laughs> I think I did about a hundred and I have about a hundred more to go but I need to work out now so I'm gonna work out and then I might finish pinning them or I might just draw tonight and then do these tomorrow I think I might do them tomorrow it's a good thing to do while I'm um, a little bit drowsy from you know general afternoon times so yeah, I might do these tomorrow, but let me work out and then I'll probably draw. Hello, don't mind the absolute mess that is my room, but I'm just popping in to talk about Skillshare, who have really, really kindly sponsored this video. And if you don't know what Skillshare is, it's an online learning community filled with thousands and thousands of videos. Um, and the topics range from so many different things. There's of course art and illustration and graphic design and photography, but there's also like latte art and blogging and freelancing, business skills. Um, there's like so many different things that you can learn on Skillshare. I think I've been using Skillshare for a couple of years now. I used it all the way throughout my uni degree. Um, just to learn some extra skills on top of my design degree. If anyone's a nerdy ass designer like me, and you know Ellen Lupton, she has some classes on Skillshare too, which I thought was really cool. 
Ellen Lupton, you're my typography queen. <laughs> but anyway, let me stop blabbering and introduce you to a class that I was taking a look at. Um, it's called Animated Illustrations by Jam Jamie Barlett. And I've always wanted to make Instagram GIFs. Although I know the basics of frame by frame animation, she goes into some techniques that I have never seen used for animation, like puppet warp. Um, so I was like, man, it's always cool to learn new skills, even if you think like, I've got this. I know how to make GIFs or GIFs, however you call them. <laughs> but yeah, I was pretty excited to see this course and I think I may finally um, make some Instagram GIF thingies <laughs> after watching this course. But also, you know how, how horrible I am at latte art and I was like, hmm, maybe there are some courses on latte art so I typed it up and there are actually latte art courses so I'm taking it up on myself to um become a master barista and impress people with my rosettas <laughs> so that's my plan <laughs> and Skillshare have really kindly offered the first thousand people who click on the link in the description a free trial of the premium membership and even when your membership finishes it's only ten dollars a month if you get the annual subscription um, and ten dollars a month is such a deal for the amount of courses that you can take and the amount of skills that you can learn so I thought it was pretty pretty rad so yeah thank you so much again to Skillshare for sponsoring this video and I'll document my learning process both with this um my quest to make finally make Instagram GIFs and also my adventures with latte art so stay tuned <laughs> but yeah let's get back to the video good morning it's Jisoo and it's about 9 a.m. on the 9th of October and I thought I would open some mail, so let's go. I have quite a lot of mail to open. Um, this is just clothes, <laughs> but I also have this pile of art mail that I've accumulated and I wanted to save opening all of them for a good day to film and Today is the day. Oh my gosh, a loud cough. Today is the day. years back I was like not very confident in myself and even vlogging like this would have been out of the question for me um, and I wasn't really comfortable in wearing very bright and outgoing clothing I wanted to blend into the background so <laughs> I would always wear neutral colors and just like a hoodie and jeans and try not to stand out as much as I could but I don't know what happened to me and my personality I think just in that like crux of turning from a teenager into an adult and getting into uni and kind of exploring what I really liked and um, and finding more confidence in my body and you know, in the person that I am as well. Uh, yeah, I think it's I think it's been a testament to how much I've grown in character as well. 
um, to see my wardrobe change into something so bright and you know I feel like it reflects the person that I am a lot more than it used to but yeah anyway that was my Lucien Yak haul I guess <laughs> um, I'll link them in the description as well as per usual and let me open some mail but before we open some mail I really want to show you a new product that came in because I'm so excited let's just, let's let's have a looky oh I can't see what I'm filming ta-da I got scratch and sniffs made so last month I was like what if I made scratch and sniffs and the what if turned into a yes if <laughs> and they look like this they're so very cute and actually a lot of them are a little bit miscut I think the company just uh they um they got the scratch and sniff line right and then they didn't get the cut line right so I don't know what happened but some of them are like really miscut so they'll definitely be on sale a lot of them will be on sale I think over, I think probably three quarters of them will be <laughs> will be on sale but that's okay sometimes these things happen and you know now you can get them at a discounted price um, but I'll just show you the miscuts they're kind of just like not on center so yeah a bit of a shame but nothing that's too devastating um, and they smell like peach they smell like peach candy my whole room smells like peach candy <laughs> They'll be on the November shop update and yeah, as I as I said, though a lot of them will be very discounted um, because of the miscuts. So and I'm also gonna be offering them in like bulk packs because I had to order a lot of them as the minimum order quantity. So if you have any cousins, if you're like a teacher or something, and you don't mind giving your kids uh, incorrect grammar internet grandma <laughs> then please buy bulk please please buy them in bulk i would be very happy um but yes i just wanted to show you because they're pretty, they're pretty cute pretty darn cute so i love these were sent um as trades but some of them were sent just like as gifts to me and I'm like, I'm so. Thank you. I don't know what I did to deserve this, but I'm very happy. So a couple weeks ago, Sophie tagged me in a um, in an Instagram story with like my Kirby pin and one of her pins. And I was like, oh my gosh, that pin is so cute! And then sent it to me. So nice! So I think this is it. <laughs> Look at this card. <laughs> That's so cute. Grumpy frog. And it's a little frog with a with a little rainbow. Thank you so much. So cute. Oh, it's a little cloud back. That's freaking adorable. Thank you so much for sending this to me. I'm going to pin it on this pair of dungarees. These are so precious. so much for sending me these. I think that was just the 
Wow, such a happy package, thank you. And for anyone who's interested in any of these, I'm going to link Sophie's Instagram and shop as well below. So thank you so much. We have a little convention table going on <laughs> here at this point. <laughs> okay, okay, let's make some make some room for the last last meal. I think everyone will know who this last person is. Vicky. So, oh my gosh, I shouldn't show my um, address, but everybody sent me the like their mail with these little frog stamps. Grace with them to me as well. Frog fans as well. <laughs> and I'm like, wow, you 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 all know me too well. I'm probably gonna tear those off the envelopes and use them in my journal or something. So <laughs> thank you. Oh my gosh, what? What? Are you freaking serious? That This is so sweet. Thank you so much. I'm like actually tearing up. Hold on. Oh, I can't. I can't now. Thank you so much. This is so freaking sweet. I'm tearing the washi tape so badly. How do I open this? Re release the froggy. This is so darn cute. Thank you so much for drawing this for me. Oh my goodness, so cute. <laughs> All of your work is like actually freaking adorable and I'm amazed. Oh look how cool that this print is. Oh my God, it's holographic. That's so cool. Packages are so cutely packed. such a happy package and I was literally crying at the start of it so <laughs> thank you so much thank you so much to everyone who sent me mail this is crazy and now I'm gonna eat Haribo's for breakfast I'm going to leave everyone's links below so totally totally make sure to check out everyone who's sent me most lovely mail because yeah I think like one of my absolute favorite things about being an artist online is meeting other artists online and like being able to buy their merch as well and I just think it's like amazing um, that we're all making things you know and like their creativity and art is just it's just great. It's just so great. And I'm so inspired and I'm so happy right now. So <laughs> I'm going to find places to put all of this lovely stuff and save all the stickers so that I can use them for my journals and decorate stuff with. So thank you so much to everyone who sent me mail. <sighs> my heart. So full. I'm watching the BTS concert. <laughs> So good! <laughs> oh 
my god, I got distracted because I had a Zoom call with Milan and um, I forgot to vlog. <laughs> but it's uh, it's 3.30 a.m. and I'm just finishing off these charms by sticking in the little pins in them. Some of them are going to get made into charms and then some of them are going to be earrings so I can kind of decide which one I want them to be later. I'm sorry about the shadows by the way. I'm in my kitchen because I'm about to I'm about to bake these. And I also have my retainers in because I'm, I'm going to go to sleep so I apologize for my for my Z's, my S's and my Z's. Um, but yeah, I'm just putting the little pins in. I actually got some new pins. I got like these, oh, these eye pins that you can um, plier twist to yourself. And I might use these too, actually. And they're just a little bit more stable because they go all the way through the pin instead of these small ones which kind of just screw into the top and can come loose. But yeah, I'm just um just plugging these in. They're baking. I go. I've just opened some amazing mail from some amazing artists so I'll show you. Um, first I got these froggy plushies, plushy keychains from Rainy Loon and this is from her Kickstarter and they're so cute. So they're like, I, I don't know how to show you, I only have two hands and there's three of them. <laughs> There they are, and I'm just gonna put them up on this shelf with all of my other frog buddies. I'm gathering quite a collection at this point, and I'm, I'll move the camera to show you my amazing, amazing package from Radion. And this package, I was grinning the entire time. Look, she wrote me a letter, and it's so pretty. Wait, that's the wrong way around. And ah, everything was so thoughtful and so sweet. So I'll stop talking and I'll show you. This original, I'm crying. I'm crying. It's me and it's Cooney. <laughs> And we have frog as Look, I'm in the mirror. <laughs> but I'm gonna have to find some frames for these, um, these two pieces. Such a happy day. I'm like, I'm so, uh, my, as usual, when my emotions get like, big, <laughs> my words start failing. Like, it's either one or the other. Either I'm like, you know, chill and my vocabulary works or I'm like hyped and I can't talk. So, <laughs> thank you so much. I'm gonna... Oh, and this scene was it's freaking amazing. I'm so in love with anything Rizzo printed and I don't want to spoil it, but it's just... I mean, it's amazing. I don't know, like, I really want to display it somewhere.
It's 2 a.m. and I'm still painting. I took a very long break because I was really tired. Um, I think I painted for a couple of hours. And you know when you just get like exhausted? And I had dinner as well. And I was like in full food coma mode. I should be able to get all these done. They're almost at their like finishing stages I need to add a couple more details I finished these two quite happy with how they turned out happy with this one as well so cute um, but I'm really glad with like the color choices that I've made I think it was good very bright and nice um, so I'm just gonna finish the last three I've already got most of the like meat cream work <laughs> I've just been watching these this Korean show all day so like my vocab is like all Korean right now but um like the underpainting so just need to add a couple details and I should be done with these two and then this one needs a little bit more work but yeah it's also turning out really nice and happy so I'm very happy. done with all these pieces and I've put my little signature on this in the corner as well so I think that's all my work for today currently the time is 4 a.m. and it's my bedtime so I'm gonna go to bed it's been a good day and I'm really really proud of how these pieces came out I haven't painted on canvas in a really really long time and it was like it takes a bit of getting used to because the paint applies differently and I usually like to use colored pencil to kind of finish everything off but since I couldn't use colored pencil I think I had to think of like a different way to put that little finishing touch on so I did like these white borders with a Posca marker and I think they just really added the final touch you know so <laughs> my brain is like going crazy right now but <laughs> really proud of myself for finishing all of these and I think they turned out quite nice I like the color palette it's very um very bright and happy yeah I don't know what I'm saying anymore so <laughs> So I'm gonna go to bed. I'll see you probably tomorrow. Good night. It's my shadow. I have three of them because I have three lights on my wall. 
by with my three heads. You got Tim Burton. Oh. Stop motion. In that you turn she boy. I'm going Good morning! Today, uh, I'm not even in the frame. <laughs> Today, I'm going to make the funky collectible stickers for patrons. And I'm also going to do the November pin design so that I can send that off quickly to my manufacturer. Every time I upload a vlog, someone asks me what my pin manufacturer is. Unfortunately, can't disclose that information because usually with manufacturers, the more um, volume of orders they get, the quality starts to drop, and also um, they just like get overloaded. So. Yeah, it's kind of hard for me to disclose that information. But there are many resources out there that will help you find a good manufacturer. There are like pin review, pin manufacturer reviews on Facebook. And yeah, I think if you just do a little bit of research, you can find a good manufacturer. I'm gonna get my crew card out, put it right here, boom. Get my iPad out, put it here, boom. And then draw my froggy, do my November pin designs, and then I can spend the rest of tonight um, packing Patreon mail or writing everyone's. Sorry, my nose is so blocked because I'm my dust allergies have been like kicking up. Yeah, then I can spend the rest of tonight writing thank you notes for Patreon because I need to write a lot of them this month. <laughs>
that it's 11.30. Woke up at like three o'clock today because my sleep schedule is crazy. But I'm gonna write, I'm gonna try to write all the little notes for this month. Um, tonight, so, well as many as I, as I can. So I put all the labels on the envelopes. This is Tocqueville International, Pink Club Domestic, Pink Club International, and then there's some, oh, that's an address. There's some stuff I've already inserted the packs in for. So these are the Toad Mail packs. And I stick the note on once I've done, once I'm done writing it. And then I just slip it into the envelope. And I haven't sealed them yet. I'm gonna seal them all at once. And um, yeah, that's what I'm doing tonight. I have literally like nothing in my brain right now. My brain's super empty. Good morning. It is November the 2nd and I'm going to send out all the Patreon mail now. Um, I'll show you it in a bit, but I've got it all in like four bags. So I think I'll have to make two trips to the post box. Um, can't carry all of them <laughs> down the street. Oh my gosh, something is here. Oh, just a reminder to give my puppy some food, which I already have, so, um, yeah, so I'm gonna have to make two trips and then come back, I'm gonna open some more slots on Patreon, and then I have to leave at about 11.30 to have lunch with my friends, so it's gonna be kind of a jam-packed morning, but, um, I think it's, this is gonna be the last day of the October vlog, the October vlog, even though it's November, <laughs> but yeah, I just wanted like a nice wrap up to the vlog and I hope you've enjoyed it so far. So yeah, I haven't even sat down to edit it yet. So who knows how it's going to be, but anyway, enough rambling. Um, yeah, let's get all the mail to the post box. <laughs> Also, since the last time I've seen you, I've um, cut my hair and I've also been like working out quite a bit. So I don't know if you can tell the difference. Yeah, it's been a it's been a good, good couple of weeks for my skin. But here are the bags that I need to take. I might take these two first and then I'll take these two. OK, I ended up just doing one trip, <laughs> but yeah, I'm gonna put everything in the box and then I'll catch you afterwards. <laughs> Why are they like this? <laughs> Oh, wow. <laughs> 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 